On Black Friday, November 23rd, activists with the Brooklyn Free Store set up in front of the Atlantic Center Mall in Fort Greene, Brooklyn. The Brooklyn Free Store is a collective that provides a space for people to give away and take items free of charge. They sought to demonstrate to Black Friday shoppers an alternative to conventional commerce. Uh, and we're just setting up a bunch of free stuff for people to uh, take on this Black Friday uh, Spend No Money Day. It's called a free store and everything is for free. Yeah. Pick whatever you need, whatever you like. We do it uh, every Friday. Uh, between 12 and 6 at Von King Park in bed -Stuy. It's a little smaller than this because we got a lot of donations like for today. But yeah, come check it out. So I was trying to get here by, by sunrise. I really thought that would be a nice touch to like be setting up the tent and having the banners flying in the morning rays. But um, we got a little bit delayed with getting the stuff on the bike trailer. There's a lot of overconsumption in America and that does nobody any good. I mean, it does the corporations good and like the bankers, but the people don't benefit. And the people would much rather have free stuff. People are really receptive to having, you know, like they're really excited to see that people are willing to go out and do like move this amount of stuff out into the public area where people can take it. Beautiful. I like it. I just took the address, so I have things also, and I will will come and give things. Wonderful. Yeah, I think this is great. This is great. This is great. So you could just come and take something. That's wonderful. That's a blessing. That's it a is. blessing. That's that's this is love. This is where and this is what is we supposed to do. Not you know, not me, 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 but share. Share the love. Share the love because God is love. And so this is what we supposed well, to do. Say, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we worked out a deal where uh, we talked to the mall security and they said that we could have this little space. So we've been like shuttling stuff back and forth, pushing cartfuls of things. Um, we got this box truck full of, like a full load of things. Um, and like we emptied out on this curb and then we're like still making trips back and forth. I don't know how many it's been, but it's been a lot. So um, we were unloading a bunch of books. This cop car rolls up. Um, and they were start, they're asking us a bunch of questions, like where we're from, a lot of, they're just being very aggressive, um, interrogating us. And um, I don't know, they, like everything that, every explanation that we gave them of what we're trying to do, they seemed like disgusted by and they're shaking their heads, like as though, like how could we get away with this? Um, and when we tried to explain what we're doing, they just told us that they weren't going to let us do anything that we wanted to. <laughs> In those words, In those, is that exactly? Those were the words they said. We, we're not going to let you do anything that you want to. <laughs> so. What, so what did you do? Um, we're like, oh, okay. Well, we're gonna. Um, we got some more things to move around. So, and just sort of like kept putting stuff out, packing and moving. <laughs> Is it this cop car here? It's this, the very one, yeah. Have you had any more exchanges with these police? Uh, no, I believe they're right there, walking towards us. <laughs> 5 o'clock. Yep. 5 p.m. <laughs> 5 p.m., hopefully. <laughs> we just want Definitely as much stuff to get taken by people who need it. Yeah, we don't we don't even need it. We don't even need it. Thank you.